an opportunity. A step up. Private sector. Very wealthy, Mike says. Could be lucrative, he says. Well, there's Weston. Let's get this shit over with. Hello. Slick. Oh, you must be Michael's boy. Oh, man. Sometimes enlightenment, it can be a real bitch. Good to meet you. Yeah, likewise, homie. We hear you're a competent repo guy, yes? This is kind of like a little hobby of mine, requisitioning the underappreciated possessions of my contemporaries for some wealthy communists in China who will value them much more. <laughs> what? Robbing my so-called friends, Slick. Why? Why? And then because selling they have them to else has because Chinese they can afford it. Because liars? frankly, I'm rich enough to do whatever the fuck I want, and you're poor enough not to ask me any goddamn stupid questions. That's not now, true. I mean that as a friend. Namaste. That's a nice fucking speech about the value of friendship. Hey, Trevor. Oh, of course, you must be the creepy one. And that's coming <laughs> from you, please. Mmm, what's going on? You're gonna dress up as traffic cops, and you're gonna rob two trust fund kids that I know and dislike intensely. Uh, why? We can get a good price for the vehicles in Asia. Look, complete the work, you'll all be well paid. You're late, sugar tits. Yep. So what's going on? Oh, oh, you finally get to realize your childhood dream and dress up as a cop. Mr. Weston's research team suggests the two boys like to ride on the Sonora Freeway. Sounds manageable. Hey, you two the hell get is going. Devin doing? Ooh, let's go. <laughs> a little yoga or something. Dog, I don't know if this shit is for me, homie. My life's already way the fuck out of control. All right, look. I'm a Darwinist brother, all right? Some prosper and some struggle. Now, are you out of your goddamn mind? This is your lucky break. Choose. Now, are you going to do this, or have you simply found your level in life? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I'll get to a wheel, homie. Hmm, what car's he got there? Okay. Get in the car. Is it this car here? Okay, what exactly are we supposed... Everybody just left me. Interesting. So, I think we're supposed to... Get in this car. Go find these... Yeah, go find these trust fund kids. And... Race them or something? Meanwhile, Trevor and Michael. Oh, well, this is a nice car. Can I have this when we're done? Trevor and Michael get to uh, chase them down dressed as cops. Not bad. So what are we doing at the gas station? Gassing up or what? Maybe that's where we meet the two trust fund kids. Hey Frank. Hey, I'm nearly with these dudes, man. You guys comfortable on your end? Yeah, I guess. We look pretty ridiculous. <laughs> All right, man. Look, I'll see you soon. Yeah. We'll pick you up coming through Grape Seed. Get the drivers there and get them going at speed. Okay. Now at least I know what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, can't wait to see Michael and Trevor dressed up as cops. All right, where... Oh, there they are. Ooh, look at those cars. Two point seven millimeters. What the fuck does this hey, How about we see which one of you two is for real? So get in your cars and let's see if they move as fast as your mom. Ooh, Ooh the fool wants to race what? us. We were just getting out of here anyway. All right. Okay, let's get him going. I don't think this car can keep up with those two cars, but we'll find out. Yeah, there, there's no way. I like how we're going down the opposite freeway. Now, I don't really need to win, I just need to get them racing at full speed.
Ooh, I overtook one of them. Oh, look at this. Hey, we're coming up now, man. Beat it in a few seconds. Got it. Whatever. Here they come. <laughs> look at these guys. I'll tell you about that later. All right, let's go pull him over. They ain't gonna stop with us back here. We gotta get right up behind them. Suspect has entered the Braddock Tunnel. Officer T maintains his pursuit. Not sure why we're going in this lane. I guess Trevor wants to live dangerously. Why do I have to get back on the bike? <laughs> okay, so I didn't park right? <laughs> Whoa, hey, stay in the car there, homeboy. I'll deal with you later. Yeah, fuck you too. <laughs> you know how fast you were going? Gee, I don't know, officer. I uh, try to keep it under the limit. Well. You and your boys look like you were drag racing from where we were sitting there, so, uh, why don't you get yourself out of the car? Come on. Officer. Officer. Is this officer. Entirely necessary? Yes, it is. Get on. Come on. Hands on the car. Let's go. Come on. Wow, get look at that car. Fucking car! Hey! Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? Fucking car. All right, we gotta make sure. Get out of the fucking car, you pint sized prick! You, you little shit, get the fuck out of here! God! These are our vehicles now. What should we do with this guy over here? Who do I want to? Okay, just don't scratch the cup. Franklin. Mars. Hello. Hey, you that lady? The intense dude's assistant, right? Assistant. This is Molly Schultz, Senior Vice President and General Counsel for Devon Weston Holdings. I need to tell Devon we got them calls. Mr. Weston will not discuss matters like this with you on the phone. I'll be your port of call for business concerns. Well, shit, me and your boss ain't gonna have any personal concerns. Bring the cars to Hayes Auto on Little Bighorn in South Los Santos. Mr. Weston and I will meet you there. Will do. So Devin's lawyer says we gotta take them to Hayes Autos in South LA. I'm gonna be there well ahead of you. <laughs> They're not driving very fast. Hey, you dudes are in the stolen ride. You ain't got no excuses for being way back there. Hey, Frank. Yeah. What did I tell you, bro? These cars. <laughs> this is an opportunity. Yeah, if you say so. You know what, right before I met you, I was boosting rides and racing. It feels like it come full circle to me. Come on! Nah, I'm serious. 
If you hadn't got me fired from my repo job, this is exactly the kind of shit I'd be doing. So thanks, dog. After all the crap we've been through, man, you got me right back where I'd be at anyway. I've written you both off. I have no idea how far back you are, but hey, look, you can eat my dust. Man, he runs his mouth, wants me to boost cars, and most likely gonna be paying me a fraction of what they worth. It don't sound that different, to be honest. Uh, you must know who this guy is. Look him up. He's the real deal. I've seen his house. He can make things happen. So he like to you what you were to me. I see your house, I think this dude can take me places. Yeah, maybe. Something like that. What's your angle, Mike? What do you mean? Like, how am I gonna beat your ass in this race? harassment in the workplace, T. Not on my watch. I'm serious. Both of you. Back off her. Trevor's in love. Whoa. Hey, your car is still all right, right? Good to see you taking this seriously, Frank. Good management. If I finna do this, I'm finna do it right. So, uh, how your car, Mike? <laughs> My car is fine. Yeah, I hope so, because I'm in charge of this shit, and I will dock your pay. The stains on the seats were here when I got in. Oh, come on, T, man, please. Trevor. a little close. Looks like buses are hitting people. Well, let's see it blow past this cop here. Alright. I beat them both back. Gentlemen, I love you all. Oh, God, this is going to be fantastic. One kid and two old creeps. Who the fuck would have thought it? Gentlemen, move the vehicles. Hey, give me five, five, and five. Oh, hey, chest kiss, homie. Boom. Dog, come on, man. You got the fucking paper? Absolutely. Look, you finish the job, you get the paper. But... The order was for five cars. If I'm not mistaken, that's only two. Just and here we go. Fucking money now! Oh, I'm so scared. I really, really am. But you know what? I'm a payment on completion of work type of guy. You don't like the job? Take a fucking walk. Hey, come on, man. Hold on. So what's next, man? Well, it's the Z type. Chad Mulligan. Lay it on him, kid. Mulligan's a record producer. He's going through a messy divorce. He's hiding his valuable assets, including the car, so that makes it complicated. He'll clock any ground surveillance we run. All we've got to go on is that the car's in a lockup in Howick. So we just go house to house? Not quite. We have access to an LSPD helicopter. The computer on board can ID pedestrians from a chip in their driver's license. Find Mulligan and Howick, follow him to the lockup, someone on the ground collects the car. All right, so who does what? You're not needed for this job. Phillips, you're in the chopper. Clinton, you're on the ground. Yeah, I don't understand the deal between you two. Yeah, well, I don't understand the deal between you two either. But you know what? Life! It's just one long mystery. Bye-bye, gentlemen, and stay spiritual. Oh, and Michael, I'll be in touch about your friend, Solomon. All right, good.
Did Devin just alter the deal? Right in front of us. I don't remember him saying five cars. And now... He says... Oh, what's this? Does this thing run? Doesn't look like it. So, at first he said, go get these two cars, and now he says, no, no, no. Payment upon completion. And there's three more cars. Okay. Somehow, I don't believe him. Well, I think Michael's gonna go home. And, uh... I guess Trevor and... Franklin will pick this up tomorrow morning and go get that Z-Type. Devin Weston sent me. Oh, oh, right. Uh, the helipad is on the roof. Okay, helipad. I guess... Gotta get up there. I don't you know... You pissed off the wrong officer! <laughs> okay. I don't know if, uh... Can I get through here? No. Uh, I don't know if I'm supposed to... Please, please! Just locker rooms. Let's go this way. If I'm supposed to... I'm putting your Ooh. ass in the cage! There was some uh, armor there. Nice. No, you got the wrong guy, man. How do I get back there? This way. You pissed off the wrong cop, baggage. So I don't know if we're 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 stealing the helicopter or what. Right along. Get on board. Okay. Yep, I'm the right along. Yep. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Boot up the scanner thing. It can pick up those new ID cards, right? When it's on, just fly where I point. Okay, booting up. You can use the stick to move the camera. Zoom in and out. It'll pick up pedestrians carrying the 2012 SA state license. If you target them, the scanner accesses the database and pulls their record. Okay. Yeah, good. We're gonna go see my pal. So hey. Researching a movie or TV? You're a screenwriter, right? Mm, not exactly. An actor? Kind of smells like you're researching a role. Hey, buddy, look, I got a confession, okay? I'm not an actor or a writer or the son of a bigwig. I'm a criminal and your boss has kind of sold you to me. Sold me? I'm afraid so. Like chattel. Huh? Now we got that clear, you need to know we're looking for a high-value automobile. Once we find it, my guy in the ground will jack it. Who we got over by the oil derrick? Here we go. Oh, man, I'll give him a scan. That must be, uh, Franklin? Yep, public exposure. <laughs> What's the deal, Franklin? Man, fuck that. I got a high ass, homie. What time I'll pick a brother up for any old shit. You want me to take it out on the LSPD representative sitting beside me? Man, just get the house. Do what we looking for is down that way. I'll follow the car. Okay. How it? You heard the man. This way. you want to go. You arrested my African-American <laughs> friend for a minor infraction? The LSPD disgusts me. Hey, it's not me. I mean, there's some bad apples in the department, but any accusation of a racist culture, uh... You wanna bullshit me? You can bullshit the freeway! We do community outreach, but we have minority quotas. Yeah, 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 your nice dick's got a minority quota. I should take... Oh, please! We've come so far in the last two decades. Oh, you're lucky I can't use this thing with one hand and fly with the other. Wait, Trevor's... Trevor's flying? We're in position over Howick Avenue. What's the name of the suspect? The dude's name is Chad Mulligan. All right? Chad, Chad Mulligan. Mulligan. Roger that. Roger. All right, let's scan this dude here. Huh? 
not Chad. Two guys on a rooftop going at it. The lady downstairs in the bikini. Let's see if we can connect the dots. All right, let's go take a look at this one. I got you, you creep. It's a free country. I know my rights. It's him. You got him. She's showing it off. She wanted me to look. You're a very sick man. Keep telling yourself that. She wanted it. What the hell is this about? Why are you sneaking around? Punch the creep. That's the buzz. You're both getting off on this. Don't try to deny it. I think you need help, man. I ain't the pervert. You are. Swingers. Please hit him. What's he doing? Who are these you people? Make me sick. Let's identify her. Ordering with intent. In area. I repeat, suspect not found in the area. And tax right, evaders. Right. Hmm. Might be a couple blocks east of Roger that. East. I'd like to hang out and see what the hell they're doing, but we have business. Oh, I guess we're going this way. Okay, where should we go first? Here? Would you look at that couple? Finally, some normal, adjusted, healthy people in this horrible town. Scan them. Oh, there he is. Chad, Ma in, who are these guys? We've got a positive ID on the suspect. I repeat, we have visual on Chad Mulligan. No vehicle in sight. All right, look, cool. We're looking for his lockup, dog, all right? Stay home and He's look out. hugging Roger someone. That. That, that I think that's his wife, looked like, or his girlfriend. Track Chad Mulligan to find out where he's parked his car. Okay. Come on, Chad. Lead us to... Surprise. Easy, pal. He's in quite a fragile state emotionally. Nice. Great. You've upset him. Uh-oh. We lost him? No, he's right there. We have lost sight of the suspect. Might have to send Pilot Boy down to draw him out. Hold on. Wait. You should come out from behind that building. Right here. Right here. I think that's him. Yep. Suspect's on foot. Okay, I see the chop. I ain't far away. Come on, Franklin. Get over here. There he is. Suspect stopped walking. Appears to be accessing a small garage. There's Franklin. All right, all right, this is it. I'm gonna get the call. Come on, Franklin. What are you doing? I guess he'd rather chase what him. What happened? Hey, look, just stay on him, man, and let me know where he is. All right. He's gonna wreck that car, though. Suspect sighted going south on Dutch Drive. Suspect going west down alley toward El Rancho. Hey, where is he, man? Going north on El Rancho. Woo, woo, woo. All units be advised. <laughs> we have a possible joyrider heading west on Howick in a black Z type. Hey man, you get another cop on this shit. Nah, homie. Now you'd appreciate Ooh. the authenticity. Oh, okay. Well, I fucking don't. Heading in an alley. Come on, Franklin, where are you? There you are. <laughs> Your boy Chad very nearly totaled the score. Oh, Chad, that was close. All right, I see him. I see him. I'm moving in. You do that, Frank. Get over there. I don't know how he's going to stop them, but... Fuck me, man. You see him? Suspect back on Del Perro heading west. Frank, you got to speed this up. He's getting away. Hey, where this fucking asshole Whoa. at? Whoa. Suspect continues west on Del Perro. 
turning. Franklin, there you are. He's turned off Del Perro, down an alleyway. Oh, he Where? went in the parking garage. Suspect last seen near parking garage. Suggest ground team clear the building. Pilot boy! Pick us down. I need to see inside the building. Okay, looks like we're gonna search level by level. <laughs> Better. Okay, where is this guy? All garage access clear. Suspect is in the building. I can't see him. I don't see him Need anywhere. Some help here, fly boy. Where is he? Uh, you can toggle to thermal vision if you think that would help. <gasps> well, you might have just turned yourself a reprieve. You know, I think I'm developing feelings for you. Okay. okay, there's one right I'm there, a little more clearly. and one right here in hey, a car, it looks the like. I'm in the middle of the garage, man, right here. There you are, Franklin. I think that could be him. Zoom in on Franklin. Why? I've got you. Hey, take a look around. Is there another heat source? We got several. We got one here that I don't think that's him. Standing over by a row of cars, middle of the floor. Wanna see what the fuck you doing? Hey, that ain't. Damn. How about this guy? Stank ass motherfucker. He's on the phone. Standing in his car to my right. Who looks like he's on the phone? Fuck. Dude could be calling the fans, homie. Nah. What else you got? Okay. Well, that's not him. Probably not. How about this guy over here? Near side of the garage! On my left! There's a man in a car! This better be him! This better be the guy! Hey, that's the motherfucker! Oh, there I he is. Yep, fit. yep. I know you think this car might be worth something, but it ain't. It's, it ain't got no resale. Zilch! They only made ten of these! Think anyone's gonna take it off your hands? It's too hot. Walk away, gangster. Walk away. <laughs> Not before you Five get down. I don't need you uh, calling the cops on me while I take your uh, Z type. Woo! What a car. Mr. Clinton. Hey, Molly, right? I got Whoa. that car for y'all. The Z type? Mr. Weston will be glad you caught us. He wanted to see it before we took off. We're on the way to his personal hangar at Los Santos International. I'll tell them to expect you at the gate. All right. Okay. Hey, I'm living the ride to Los Santos International. Hey, is the lady gonna be there? Or just a dick who ain't paying us till we get all the cars? Don't Shit, know. I think they both gonna be there, dog. Devin and Molly. Say hello from me to Molly. Man, I ain't hitting on nobody for you, man. Least of all, her. God, why not? It's about time I settled down. Shit, man, you need like a lion tamer or some shit. <laughs> this girl, man, she got balls, dog, but she needs some serious stones to handle your ass. Just say hello. Sure, man. Man, I ain't gonna be a part of that. After everything I've done for you, ah, you are just like Michael. Well, I am his protege. I, I did. I'm supposed to deliver this in good condition, so we'll try and be careful while we drive. Ooh. All right. Uh, where are we going here? Aha. Looks like Devin has his own hangar. Hey, I'm supposed to meet Devin Weston here. Mr. Weston's hangar is up there on the left. Look at that police helicopter hanging up over there. I don't know what he's doing. Or is that Trevor? That may be Trevor. Here we go. He's got his own private little jet. Oh, there she is. <laughs> 
you know, if this beauty was a woman, I'd have to break my 20 and under rule. Man, I'll just stick to driving, all right? <laughs> hey, tell me something. You know how many of these things they make? Uh, shit, like 10? No, not like 10, man. Exactly 10. Oh, wow, man. You one of them type of dudes, huh? Tell you something. How'd you like to drive a car like this one day, man? For real. I can. Like this? Or this. Oh, man, right back at me, homie. Really nice. Hey, you know something? You're not like those uh, snowbird retiree pals of yours. You are sharp, man. Man, I'm just looking for a paycheck for my services. No, no, no don't worry. It'll come. That'll come. But right now, it is life lesson time, pal. You have got to wake up to what's real in this situation, bro. Take me, right? I am opportunity. I'm security. I'm fast cars, blow jobs. I got the world on a plate. Those two clowns, oh, man, they are the worst kind of disaster that can ever come down. They are a full core meltdown, and you're just standing there soaking up major radiation. You have got to take stock, man. Make that call before it's too late. Yeah, all right, man, I will. Before it's too late, man. Yeah, yeah. Just take any car and go. Thanks. So, was he trying to recruit me just now? So what do we want? I think, oh, these are the same car. Okay. I don't know if he's leaving or what. I'm gonna do some donuts here though. How's that? Yeah, okay. Let's get out of here. Wait, wait, wait. Are any of these cars better? Not really. I guess we'll take this one. Well, I think, okay, that was what? That was three cars, so we got two more to go. And they say then they were going to get paid after that. Well, we'll see. We better get paid. Or else I'm going to be a little bit upset at uh, Mr. Weston. That's all we have for this episode, though. Thanks for watching, and uh, hope to see you next time.